What's good, YouTube? It's your boy D Money here back with another banger reaction, man. And today I have here for you guys Tupac Road to Glory. Hey, this is the uh, Mike Tyson edition, man. I had I had something I needed something to watch, bro. You know what I mean? I can't just sit here and watch a, a screen the entire time. You dig what I'm saying? Uh, before we start this video, guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. A lot of you guys are watching the vids, but aren't subscribed. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button to help support the channel. Also, comment down below what you guys want to see next. And I got y'all, man. Y'all been showing me so much love, and I really do appreciate that. If you guys want to check out the original video, it will be down in the description below. And uh, if you guys want to follow me off of YouTube, follow me on all social media, Daryl's World, Instagram, all that, man. You feel me? I ain't going to hold y'all too much longer, man. We're going to get right into this video. I think in the last video I said something about to glory feel with my heart leave it was my thoughts from my brain and I trained to remain strong and said I couldn't do it lock me in chains till I my struggles closer to the pain of a change hey this shit is still it's crazy bro because they it, it's still it's still happening to this day bro and the, and the crazy thing is it's not even it's not even just certain people that we thought it's like our own people that be like hey you can't do this shit you know what I mean that that'll tear you down so you can't do it bro just, just saying. Killer, please believe that I'll never be shamed again. Again, I'll be the next heavyweight champion. Call me crazy, but no one can fake me. I'm the product of the projects. Lost and crazy. Mm -hmm. your hands up. Bro, when you... <laughs> hey, he said no one can phase me. No, hey, pretty much no one can beat me, bro. Because when you come out of the projects, when you come out of... When you come out of poverty, nigga, you don't have nothing to lose. I'm going to be honest with y'all. You have nothing to lose, bro. So all you, all you got is just heart. And I get heart and dedication. Like, I can't lose because if I lose, I'm going to get sent back down into that place that I don't want to ever be in, bro. You know what I mean? Them nights where you ain't eat nothing, nigga. You ain't even had no bread. Nigga, you had nothing but water from the faucet. Like, nigga, you never want to go back. Mr. Bruno, ride. Big Mike Tyson about to brutalize that ass tonight. No hesitation for the whole nation. I'll be there that's so bad. I'll probably violate probation through demonstration that I strategize information. I beat that ass so bad, I probably violate probation. Like, come on, bro. That shit was fire. Mike Tyson was a whole different beast, though, too. It's, it's, I'm seeing the dude work out, man. Like he was a whole beast. Cases. Let the world know I plan to die. If I don't leave with what I came for, I'm be denied. Mm. Now, my first round for the times that I spent in the sale. The second round for the media and the lies they tell. The third round for the pain that I felt inside. Let's recognize I won't be denied. When we ride. First rounds for the times that I spent in the sale. The second rounds for the media and the lies they tell. The third mm. rounds for the pain that I felt inside. Let's recognize I won't be denied. We'll be fine. My road to glory filled with thorns. Fluent thoughts from my brain, and I trained to remain strong. They said I couldn't do it. Lock me in chains till I my struggles closer to the pain of a chain killer. Please believe that I'll never be shamed again. Or can I be the next heavyweight champion? Call me crazy, but no one can fade me. I'm the product of the project. That sounds Lost me crazy. Throw your hands up, Mr. Bruno. Rob, pick my tights and bop the boot. If I don't come with what I came, hey, that's literally one of the hardest lines, bro. Like I told y'all, shit, you put like these, they, they put hard work in, bro, and they put hard work in to stay at the top and put hard work in to never go back down to where they came from. I mean, you don't forget where you came from, but you never want to go back to that spot. You know what I mean? In that position. And best believe, I'm going to try to... I'm, then they, when, when Mike Tyson went out there, bro, he went out there to try to kill him, kill his opponent. Like, dead ass, bro. He, he wasn't going out there just to try to knock him out. Like, he was trying to go kill him. Like, nigga, like, kill them. Literally. Like, for real, for real. And y'all, yeah, trust me, bro. Trust me. Like... When you got people that spar with them and shit, and they tell you like what how his mindset was, bro, it's crazy. Uh, you know what I mean? And Mike Tyson just wasn't the man to fuck with, and he still ain't to this day. I'm said I'm spitting the sale, the second rounds for the media and the lies they tell, the third rounds for the pain that I felt inside. Let's recognize I won't be denied. Won't be fine. First rounds for the times that I spit in the sale, the second rounds for the media and the lies they tell, the third rounds for the pain that I felt inside. Let's recognize I won't be denied. Won't be fine. Mm. I am Mike Tyson. 
the first round, you know, because I spit the cell. Second round, he said, uh, something. I forgot. God damn, I don't forgot the damn hood. Third round is to shut up the media. Oh, no, no, no. The second round was the media, and then I guess the third round was. Bad motherfuckers, bro. Both of them. Both of them was bad motherfuckers. You got one in the, in the music industry that was just killing it. You know what I mean? And then you got one that was in the boxing ring that was just dominating the sport, bro. Like, a good combo right there, bro. Like, I'm telling you, Mike Tyson, different level, bro. Different mindset. That's why he won. That's why he was a champ. Tupac, different mindset. You know what I mean? That's why he was on top. You know what I mean? It was between what? Biggie and Tupac at the time. You know what I mean? Uh, if you guys enjoyed that video, man, let's try to get 20 likes on this video, bro. Y'all been smashing the like button. Y'all been fucking with the kid, all right? I got the pranks. I got the vlogs. I got what you need. All you need to do is subscribe to me. I'm out of here, man. Peace.